Hi, I'm Alicia, and I'm going to show you how to enter a contest. First, you'll need to pick a contest. Let's click on Community, and then Contests. You'll see any open contests, because under Stage, it'll say Open. Go ahead and click on the contest you want to enter. You can read the description, but most importantly, you want to read the rules. This will tell you the requirements your game needs to meet in order to enter the contest. Let's go ahead and look at our game. You're going to want to go to My Games and click on your contest entry. Some contests have certain requirements specific for the contest, like a price limit, components, digital rules, and more. But every contest has a consistent rule, like making your game publish ready. This doesn't mean that you need to publish your game. It just needs to be publish ready or meeting the requirements to be published. The first step to this is making sure your game is fully proofed. What this means is that you have reviewed all your images you've uploaded. You can tell if images are unproofed by these little icons right here. Hovering over it will tell you what needs to be proofed. Let's go ahead and proof the items that need it. You can click on the item and either use the eyeball icon or the proof all icon. You're going to want to review your image, make sure it meets all the requirements, enabling and disabling the cut area, and approve if everything looks good. Do this for all images that need to be proofed. Another requirement is to upload a digital version of your rules. Let's click back on Make. And then over here on Downloadable Files. You'll want to upload your rules here. They can be PDF, PNGs, or JPEGs. Simply drag and drop it in. Make sure to set it to free so people can download your rules and read them for the contest. Now let's move on to some additional requirements on the Cell tab. This first section is Overview. This is where, if you wish to publish your game, you can. However, remember this is not required for the contest. Next up is Vitals. Some contests will have player requirements and time requirements, so make sure to adjust these to match the requirements for the contest. Let's go ahead and set this to 2 to 4 players, 30 minutes, and 12 plus. Next is your pricing. Some contests will have a price requirement. For example, for this current contest, your cost cannot exceed $74.99. That's referring to the cost here and not your MSRP. Next is a required marketing tab. Make sure to fill all of this in, as well as upload an advertisement. You can find the size of your advertisement down here. Let's go ahead and fill this in. Now let's move down to Safe Search. Make sure to fill any of these in based on your game. Now let's go down to Shop Page. Similar to before, you're going to want to upload a shop backdrop and a game logo, and their sizes are listed here. Let's go ahead and do that. You'll also need to add a shop page description. Make sure to save and preview. If a contest asks that you have a video, you can simply copy and paste the URL of your video from YouTube into the description and it'll automatically embed it on your shop page. Now let's go to Shop Preferences. While this doesn't have a required icon, it is something you need to make sure you change. Under Allow Viewing Even When Unpublished, select Yes. This will allow people to view your game during the contest. Under Taxonomy, it allows you to categorize your game in the shop. You do not need this for the contest. Next is Action Shots. These are required for the contest and can be renders of your game in action and cool things about your game. Let's go ahead and upload a couple. Once you have finished all these required steps, it is time to enter the contest. Click on the Test tab. Then click on Enter a Contest. You'll see listed all the contests you qualify for. Go ahead and hit Enter Contest. If for some reason you're missing a requirement, a warning box will pop up and tell you what you're missing so you can correct it. Remember, you can enter a contest at any time before the deadline, and you can still make changes to your game after you enter. As long as there is still time before the deadline, you can make changes. I recommend entering as soon as you can to ensure you don't miss your chance. Once entered, you're all set. And that's how you enter a contest. Thanks for watching.